This train is about to leave the station, headed around the world, spreading the good gospel and inspirational music. Your conductor, Elder James Lockhart, bringing the world the very best in inspirational and gospel music.
guest lord. In Jesus' name. Man, Miss Bonita Ward, everybody. She's in the building. Funny, funny, <laughs> funny comedian. Let me tell you something. Miss Bonita Ward is not only just a funny comedian, but she's a real comedian, like in church. <laughs> I, I, I just want to know can okay. Miss Bonita Ward sing? Can Bonita Ward sing? Can you sing, Miss Ward? I can sing solo, baby. Oh, sing, do, oh. Yeah, I can sing solo. Oh, y'all getting an exclusive? What happened yeah. when you come me, to me, the... me, me, me. Mm -hmm. Ooh, yeah. Mm -hmm. I can't sing, baby. Oh, yeah. got everybody excited. Mm -mm, got, psych. Got everybody psych. excited. See, mm -mm, the comedians mm -mm. be getting you, boy. Yeah, I can't sing. I sang in the shower. No, solo. That's why, see, God knew I couldn't sing. That's why he put that scripture in there just for me. <laughs> he did. He said, make a joyful noise unto the Lord. And that's what I do. I be making a joyful noise. I be so happy. Look, I be thinking, I, look, I be thinking I be sounding like Beyonce. I do. All the single ladies. Yeah, I thought I was, I thought I was sounding like Beyonce. Oh my God, man! When Miss Miss D Michelle came in, I saw you on the fly. Like, yo, uh, you in for a treat with Miss Miss Benita Ward? That lady is off the chain. <laughs> like, man, I was telling her. Then I told T, uh -huh. T Brown, we had this interview. I was like, bro, had you never heard? Her? Like, she goes in. Oh. And it's just real stuff. And I, what I like about it's just stuff that. No people think they're holding it down. They they feel that way, but they don't want to say it. Yeah, I'ma you know? say it. Yeah. Man, look, you know how the people are like I went on a man for God. I'm just waiting, I'm waiting. Yeah. This war tell you straight up, yeah, I'm waiting, but I ain't stupid. Right. And they be like, Oh, yeah. oh, one of my favorite yeah. ones, she said, Look, I ain't paying my I ain't paying no man child support when you <laughs> said that, like the air in the room was <laughs> like <laughs> They got something Holy Ghost suffocated. Look, look, they had a spiritual asthma attack. They was like they, you see people looking at each other like, we ain't together no more. I'm done, I'm done paying your child support. It's confirmation. The Lord told the comedian to tell me I'm not paying for your kid no yeah, more. So, yeah. man, tell us where you from, how you got started, how you been doing, how long you been doing comedy. Let us know. Talk to um, us. Talk to the people. How I got started doing comedy, I've been a fool all my life. But, um, <laughs> I ended up doing this comedy because I worked at the hospital. So one night, me and my friends had went out to uh, laugh out loud mm -hmm. over there by North Star. And they were like, it was open mic night. So I didn't know that it was open mic night. I had never been to mm -hmm. anything like that. So they was like, get up there, get up there, be you funny. Do all the, say all the jokes you be saying at the hospital. And I'm like, I just say them. I don't. Yeah, and I just, right I just come yeah. on like I don't just write this stuff down you know what I mean so mm -hmm. I got up there and the guy Ruben he was like oh man how long you been doing this cause you funny and I was like um about 10 minutes <laughs> 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 and from that it just took off Oh my from that, god! It just took off. Yeah, I, was, I seen you. Where, where you from? Where? I'm from Cleveland, Ohio. Oh, Cleveland! It's yeah, some legends out of Cleveland. You yeah. got you got Zap and Raj out of Ohio. You got Jerry Levert. Jerry Levert. You uh -huh. got. Yes, it's so many. LeBron I can go. You look you Miss Benita Ward. Yeah, it's just a bunch of you know, it's a bunch of y'all out of Ohio. So, um, first time I actually saw you was at a fundraiser for the Hurricane for um Hurricane Harvey and. Mm -hmm. Um, shout out to B. Smitty for putting yes, that together. And I yes. think I was the only poet up there. And it was just weird. Like, I don't got no jokes. <laughs> and, like, a matter well, of fact. You are amazing. God be the you glory, Miss Ward. You are amazing. God be the glory. It was crazy because, like, you was right. I saw you in the crowd reacting to the punchlines. I'm like, oh, I'm killing it. Yes. But I did not know you was the clothes, the, the game, the, the, the showstopper. I was like, <laughs> she got on stage and just went off man i was just like man this is this is it's, it was some real stuff they would made it funny it was everyday stuff that was simple but it was so real yeah it was so real do you yeah. how do you feel about you notice it i i didn't i tried what i do not do especially as an entertainer and just been in the industry i don't introduce per I introduce people by gen by gender right 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 you know it's like so same thing i'm I, as five starter was like being that you're a female rapper a female, a female MC. Let me say MC because she's an MC. She mm -hmm, got bars. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's, a yes, it's, it's a difference. Yeah. So, um, as you've been a comedian and being that you're a woman, is is it is it complex? And, and you, then you're doing it in in church. Yeah. With the stone faces. Okay? Yeah. You know. Yeah, you I know, blow on them. <laughs> you know. You said blow on these bones. I be you know, <laughs> you know the people that got that like they're to laugh. They don't yeah. want to laugh, but they yeah. hold. They be like, yeah. <laughs> God, yeah. the glory. So how you, so just tell, like, how is it 
just in that arena as a Christian comedian, how is it in that arena? And how is it different from being, I guess, in the world doing jokes? And I know I'm sure your message are the same, but yeah. the different response you get for is being in the church house and then being in, you know, other places like Laugh Out Loud. Mm -hmm. Um, well, in, in church, you know, all my all, I do clean comedy. Let's yeah, get that out there. Yeah, I do you clean definitely comedy. Do. And uh, when people when you say clean comedy, people think, Oh, you just don't cuss. No, I come in with a message. Yeah, definitely. You know what I mean? I come with all my comedy have a message. And that's what I want to bring. I want to bring Christ to the world in a funny way. Yeah, you definitely. know what I mean? Because sometimes as believers or the church as a whole, people think, oh, if I start going to church, I can't do this, I can't do that, I can't do this, I can't do that. And that's not the life that God ordained for us definitely. to have. You know, he said, I came that you might have life and have life more abundantly. Mm. So it's about taking this gospel to the nation through comedy mm -hmm. and making people laugh. Definitely. You know what I mean? Definitely. Sometimes we need to laugh at our mess because when we stop and think about it, Yes, sir. We interrupt this program due to the fact that love is passing by. And Miss Benita Ward, you have been chosen to be loved. We have a special invitation to be able to join in on this. Love. Okay, we got the love boat. The love boat theme going on as it's raining outside. Yes. You know. <laughs> I like that. Miss Benita Ward? Yes, sir. Because this is the love book. Yes, I like the love book. We love yeah. the way you move. I like it. I'm going to move some more then. Come on now. <laughs> oh my God. I'm going to move some more. San Antonio and Global Listeners, <sighs> if you feel the love, you ought to be moving to <laughs> right along with Miss Benita Ward. <laughs> and now, and now, Back to Legacy City. You are not tuning in to KROV FM, Real Gospel Express, as we are leaving the love boat. I have no radio voice at all. So let me just, <laughs> whenever to stay, stay in my lane. Then we just talked about that the other show. Look, I'm staying in my lane. <laughs> Look. She important. Look at somebody. She's somebody my, trying to look, call my somebody there. She didn't play the love boat right. and boot and call. He's like, I got your love boat. You better learn to swim today. <laughs> I wish I had a boot so you could pay half these bills. <laughs> we can't be boo if you don't pay. Uh, hey, mm -hmm. that that whole company skit about that. When you went down that list of things that you were not gonna, she said, uh, it was. I, I, I don't want to mess it up, but it was like, um, you like. Pretty much, I'm saved, but God is still work with me. Yeah. It was pretty much she said, I'm saved, but you can still catch these hands. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't know why church folk want to act saved and act like they ain't got no thug in them. You, you know what you I'm know saying? What I'm saying? Hey, baby, look, you ain't going to let nobody mess with your cheering. Look, I, it's three things I protect. Uh -huh. My faith, uh -huh. my pastor now, uh -huh. and my money. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I, yeah, that's pretty much about it. You know what I mean? Cause uh, like, don't mess with them things. Them things is important to me. You know what I mean? And when we get at church, we act like, oh, well, praise the Lord. The Bible says, turn the other cheek. Well, that's Jesus. Jesus is able to turn the other cheek. My name is Benita. You understand? I haven't arrived at turn the other cheek ministry yet. You know what I mean? God is still working on me through grace and mercy and Definitely. faith and prayer. Definitely. So. I think uh, this is what I, I, I feel, Miss Miss Ward. When it comes to the top, some of the topics that you was talking about, it was just special. Shout out to you, shout out to your pastor, man. <laughs> yes, yo, Dante Banks, yo, God Chases Community Church. Hey, yo, look, she said uh, when you when you get that text message, when you about to do wrong. Yeah, your pastor <laughs> sent you that text message. <laughs> I'm like, oh, you gotta go. You like, go on, get out yeah. the house. Look, yeah, you know, you uh, might be might be in the midst of you know trying to get your <laughs> sanctified sexy on, and then your pastor send you that text message, know ye not that your body is the temple of the. I'm like, ooh, that's the Lord's doing. Get out my you house, bow leg. Get out of here. You gotta go. You gotta go. I'm sorry, it's not you. Oh. It's me. <laughs> it's not you. It's me. It's Jesus. This is the funny part, though. When she said it right. Everybody who's a member of the church was like, he sure do be texting you at the wrong time. <laughs> Look, everybody told on themselves. I'm like, you know what? 
after this comedy show, we were having an altar call because I yeah. was there. Everybody yeah. was, they were too happy about that joke. Yeah. I was like, man, yeah. that joke is crazy, man. Yeah. <laughs> They're like, no, he sure did be texting you randomly. Yeah, my I pastor was, always sent us encouraging. And it's, Dante Banks and Tabitha Banks are the pastors of God Church Community Church. I love my church. Baby, I will cut you about my church. Just, you, know? you know what I'm saying? I I'm love my you. pastor because they feed my soul. The Bible says Jeremiah 315 that I'll give you pastors after my own heart definitely. who will feed you wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. So don't mess with Dante and Tabitha Banks because I will cut you. First you know, of all, they got my destiny Dante, in their back. They, they Dante and Tabitha. They sound like two thugs today. They're like, That's yo, they right. don't, not they, like in a bad way. They thugs I'm just in the like, Holy Ghost. They, they'll tear something up. They thugs in the I, Holy Ghost. It was yes. funny. Look, hey, look, when y'all, because you're not the only one that cracked jokes about right. Pastor Banks. Uh huh. So, like, when everybody would give their testimony and share about Pastor Banks, Pastor Banks was like, Shug in the booth. He was like, this. <laughs> you're right. <laughs> <laughs> you're right. You better yeah. not mess up. So to be there in tune with your with with your pastor, so that's a that's a beautiful thing. And the yes. fact that he supports y'all ministry and understand, cause like when I was going, I had to tell my mom like uh, for me to, to really just enjoy church, I had to find something. I had to make my own lane. Yes. To yes. Keep, to keep me keep me there, you know what yes. I mean. And so being that, and also I just want to mention to people that you are a military veteran as well. Yes, I am. And how long did you live? You served mind? 15 years Ooh, in the military. I got God. out in February 2003. Woo! Oh, yeah. Woo, 15. Yeah, I would have stayed, but my my sons ended up having cancer. So, oh my God. Um, that's what made me get out, and yeah. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Um, I know how cancer affects family. Mm-hmm. Head on, man. It's something serious. But we you know I have a. My sister, I call my big sister. I probably heard the way to put away cancer movement. If you yes, haven't heard, yes. you probably need to yes, get with I heard her. You mentioned yeah, that's before, yeah. Uh, we'll do that offline. I give you the information. Talk to her. Yes. She's very supportive of, like, she has a heart for it. Yes. You know what I mean, yeah. a heart for it. So, yes. shouts out to put away cancer as well. So, mm-hmm. but um, s- social media is how can we follow you? What do you have coming Look, up? I'm not good at technology. <laughs> So she I need an assistant. She can listen. Yes. Somebody need to help her. I need help, y'all. Help me. I don't. I'm not a computer person. You know what I mean? Yeah, definitely. So I'm not. I don't know how to do all the twitters and Instagram. I'm a dinosaur when it comes to computers. Like I, I know how to do Facebook, and that's only because my son put the f on my phone. <laughs> so I know how to click that to get on Facebook. But that's as far as my skills go. Like I know how to work the ATM machine and the gas pump. Baby. <laughs> so you know. <laughs> I'm not, you know, th- yeah, I'm struggling right there. You know, I'm struggling. <laughs> Most people struggle with drugs and alcohol. I struggle with this computer. <laughs> yes, it's a struggle. You know, I don't Look, know I got this. a brand new computer for Christmas, and it's still in the box. Oh, Lord. I, it's still in the box because I don't even know how to cut the thing out. I don't know what to do with no computer. Okay. Hey, can we can we hey, can we go we, out? We're gonna take a break. Okay. We'll, 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 take okay. A break. we'll be back, but we're gonna take a break. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> San Antonio San Antonio. San Antonio oh, it's no place like <laughs> Oh my god. Oh yes, no place like here, right here in K R O V F M. Well we would just want you to know we are so glad. We are so glad to have her. But we gotta take a break right now. Oh. <laughs> Man, got me with the Tyrese face. I'm crying on camera. <laughs> <laughs> That's when you get that ugly. <laughs> Man. But I love Tyrese though. That was good though. Yo, t- they mess a- with my boy, but I love me some Tyrese. Yeah, y'all, this Miss Bonita Ward, man. Y'all got questions, ask questions. Yeah, ask I'm, me some questions. I'm here with the conductor, Mr. James Lockhart, as well, Elder James Lockhart. Yeah. So we're here doing our thing, man. You know, so Five Starter came through and did her thing with Miss JJ Jameson as well. Yeah. Y'all heard that new T. Bryant, Hold oh, Me Jesus. Yes. I definitely want to encore that. Definitely yes. got to encore that. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully, we can hear a new, new, uh, Elder Lockhart too. We'll see if we can get that thing dropped. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I was going to get Miss Bonita Ward. Hey, you know, you should do a comedy album. I would love to do a comedy album. We should we should work that. Yeah. Get you some material. Yeah. Show me, tell me what to do. Like, Cause I don't know, you know. Like Richard Pryor needs to do better. Yeah, I would love oh, it. Yeah, San Antonio Global Listeners is crazy all up in here. Right like, <laughs> along with me today is none other than Legacy Sentity. Yeah, yeah. And also we have with us. Uh, uh, what's your name? My name Bernita Ward. That's what my mama said. <laughs> my mama said my name was Bernita Ward. My mama said. Yeah, my mama told me that. <laughs> hey. 
This is Keith's Wonder Boy Johnson. I have a message for you. I done so. Keep this on your mind And remember That I told you Daddy done so Thank <laughs> you. 
I like this song. Thank you. Put that in my car with the bass on. Oh, okay, I got you. <laughs> I gotta give you the higher praise. Hallelujah. That's all right. I'm still cute with one, you know. Uh huh. You feel the burn in hell. Hey, y'all, shots out. This is uh, Crazy Praise. Legacy City feature our life. Elder snuck this one in on me, you know. So I wasn't expecting this one. You don't expect it though. We got Miss Bonita Ward in the building as well. Make sure y'all tune on KRVFM.com, Bring My Gospel Express. Alright? We're gonna wrap this thing on up. Yeah, yeah, you are tuning to Rima Gospel Express on KROVFM.com with the beautiful Miss Bonita Ward in the building. And we got the conductor himself, James L. Lockhart. Choo -choo. Choo -choo. So we did that like the pips. Yeah. We taking a train to Georgia like God, I'm glad yes. this night. You saw that punchline? Yes, Snuck it in. I like that. <laughs> I like that. So we're gonna wrap this up. We got like five more minutes before we wrap this thing up. Miss Benita Ward, what do you have anything that's coming up soon? Yes, what I'll have there? December the eighth, I'll be at the Ramada Inn for the Gospel Love um Christmas uh show. So I'll be that's by Dre Coop. So I'll be there. Shout out to Dre. Hey, Dre I, see you. I see you. Um so I have that on December the eighth. Okay. I have uh Martin Luther King, uh I have a dream gala uh January thirteenth. Okay. And I'll be opening up for Ricky Smiley, Charlie Wilson, and Keith Sweat. Uh, T Brian, that's, yeah, that's my brother. That's my brother. Yeah. Ricky Smiley. Smiley. My brother. The cute dogs. Right. I'm an AKA. So, uh, <laughs> oh, yeah, okay. Hey, what time we go? Something like that. Okay. So, um, we'll be, I'll be opening up for him February 14th in Cleveland, Ohio. Yeah, you going home and represent yeah, with Ricky Smiley. I'm super excited. Don't I'm not, super I'm excited. I'm so proud so you got we have, you. we have Cleveland, Ohio, Atlanta, South Carolina, and his hometown. Oh, so Alabama. you on tour tour? Yeah. Oh, you yeah. on, oh, you tour yeah. touring. Okay. Yeah. Oh, look so at I'm super you. excited. Oh, man. I, wow. That's all. I'm super excited. Boss. <laughs> that's what, that's what our five stars say, boss moves. Yeah, so definitely, excited. definitely, ma'am. Thank you for having on the show. We gotta get your social media game up so people yes, can follow you. Yes, yes. Y'all can all... follow me on Facebook I'm, as Bernita Ward. Okay. You know, just click on my page, follow me. I don't want you black my grandma, but she got internet for a typewriter. <laughs> right. I'm, I, I'm, you know, I'm right there you're... with grandma. <laughs> so, I'm right there with grandma. We're gonna close this thing out. Y'all yes, just heard that new T. Brian. Y'all got Miss Bernita Ward. If you yeah. wanna find her dates and stuff for that name, you go back to the uh the Facebook okay. and watch everything. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna wrap this thing up. Thank you for listening to Rima Gospel Express on KROVFM.com. That's where you can find it at, but that's what it really is. This yes. is Legacy City. I'm signing out. Log out. Talk to you later.